You ready for this towel reveal, guys? Yes. Here we go. <laughs> Here we freaking go. What's up, my beautiful babes? So, oh, this is gonna be a fun video. I don't know why I haven't thought of this video idea sooner. I mean, ombre, bad ombres have been a problem for the last few years, and I have seen a lot of DIY ombres walking the streets, and girl, they are bad. <laughs> Like, my, I can't even look at them sometimes. It just hurts me really deep down inside. It really hurts. It is like a pet peeve of mine to watch people that don't know how to do an ombre do an ombre. Cause they're actually, they're, they're pretty difficult and it takes a lot of artistic talent to make a very nice ombre. It's one of the more difficult things to do uh, within the hair coloring realm. So, People think it's super easy, like you just look at their hair and you're like, oh, well, you just paint pieces. Like, no, there is a lot to it, I swear. <laughs> so, girl, I am ready. Let's watch these girls do some ratchet at-home ombres. <laughs> Let's get it started. Okay, so our first girl is named Chelsea Holbler. Holbert. I think that's how you say it. What's up, Chels? She's about to do a DIY ombre hair fail and I am beyond ready for it. Hey guys, what's up? Hey Charles. Chelsea here. I am so freaking excited. <laughs> I'm so excited, you guys. The time has finally come. The time uh -oh. is finally here, we got a box here, in our hand. I'm gonna dye my hair. Weird stage where it's still a little bit ombre, but it's like barely anything. So I'm about Just to take up a notch. If you know. And I am about to ombre this freaking shit, okay? I'm about to ombre it up in here. And I'm pumped. Can you ah, tell? Can you tell? Ombre it up, girl. You guys, really, Give me that ombre, honey. I'm really stoked. I've been wanting different hair for a while now. And I'm pretty Yes, pretty box day realness. Let me just get this on the Snapchat story, you know, so everybody knows. <laughs> Got it. It's going on the story. Full disclosure, guys, I honestly have no freaking idea what I'm doing. Yeah. I've dyed my hair before, okay, so I know how to do that. Um, I've skimmed some YouTube videos. Okay? Perfect. That's a great start. Skim them. I've looked at Pinterest. I've seen all the pins. There you I go. I read the instructions, but I'm really just kind of doing this. That is all you need. As long as you've looked at Pinterest, watched a few tutorials by other people on YouTube who are not real hairstylists, um, that's all you need. <laughs> Read some box dye instructions. You are ready to go, girl. This is more of just like a ha ha ha, let's see if she can actually freaking do this video. <laughs> so I don't exactly know what I'm doing. I've seen oh, watched some you don't say. and I've seen some pictures. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna rubber band off sections of my hair. Here we go. I guess there's no turning back. What is this? this? What is this? Oh, what is I'm terrified. This? Why am I so afraid? You should be. There's no turning back now. Holy crap. Oh, okay. yeah. She didn't know. Oh, what do I do about these Wait, she's pieces? literally just doing oh, a half okay. inch of the tips of her hair. to go to a salon when you can buy this thing for $8 and do it yourself. You know, it might not be that bad because she put the ponytails in so that way when the hair comes down, this hair from here is gonna be at a different level from the hair up here, if that makes any sense. So it's gonna give her kind of like an ombre feel, even though it won't be that good, but it'll still be like kind of an ombre. We'll see what happens. I don't understand. Okay, so I've saturated the tips. I've put Just a lot the tip. of dye on the tips, and I'm gonna let that sit for 10, 10 to 12. Oh, she's got a little technique minutes. here. Okay. And then I'm going to go up a little bit higher and do that section, let that sit for about five minutes. Oh, and this is actually really interesting. See how it looks then. Guys, it's actually really mm -hmm. making me nervous how dark this looks. Like, did they screw up and give me the wrong thing? Because this. Oh, I just realized what's happening right now. This is not bleach. This, she got hair color. Hair color does not lift hair color. You can't put a lighter box hair color over an already existing color on your head. If you have color in your hair, color does not lift color. So this is gonna do probably nothing to her hair. Let's keep watching. This doesn't look any lighter. Well, 
Anyways, it's been my allotted okay. time, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go up a little, a little bit higher. And <laughs> it's I'm literally, sit it's turning her darker. 15 minutes. You're probably okay, going to cry. the time is up. It still looks really dark, and I'm really, really, really nervous about it. But I'm going to go rinse the hair out because I'm not going to leave this crap in my hair for like three hours waiting for it to get lighter. <laughs> it's not going to so do gonna anything. 45 minutes is kind of like where it stops working, but your hair is not going to process any more if you leave it on for longer than an hour. Nothing's going to happen. This is a lie. This is some grade A bull. You ready for this towel reveal, guys? Yes. Here we go. <laughs> Here we freaking go. And here's my hair. Oh. Looks freaking dark. And Hold on. It actually looks kind of good. Why does it say fit? Why is she mad? What? It could have came out so much worse than this. This is what I'm working with. I like it. I am thoroughly, thoroughly confused. And what I mean, I followed the instructions. it doesn't look that great, but like it's not bad for an at home ombre. I think I'm coming to terms with the hair now. It's been about <laughs> three hours. Chelsea, if you're watching, you gotta use bleach next time. All right, we got this next one by Korea Clip. Oh, Korea Clip. Oh, wait. Okay, so this brand, like. I don't know if you'll see what it is, but you basically clip it in your hair and you can like cut your own hair at home. And apparently you can use it to do an ombre. We're gonna have to see how this comes out. Okay. Hi, I'm Mai Lu, inventor of the Korea Clip. Today, I'll yes, show queen. You how to color your hair. She's First, about to go put in. Hair over and comb out any knots and tangles. Wow, she's really gorgeous hair. Holding the Korea Clip with the curve and she's about to. Down. Get up. Hair closest to the roof. Then slide the Korea clip all the way down to the ends. If you want less color, then slide the Korea clip further down. Oh god. Now apply color to all the oh, hair Oh god. The eye. We recommend no. wear safety glasses to prevent color from getting into your eyes. And she's not wearing any. <laughs> Continue to apply color on both sides. Sure, this looks clothes just clothes. like too much work, honestly. <laughs> now get a friend to hold it for you while you color your hair. Making sure you apply okay, queen. Color. Get that saturation. Here is the end result. I already washed and blow dried the hair to show you the color. With this technique, you can color the ends of your hair. What is that? What is that? What is that? Um, Miss Crea Clip. Why is there a highlight just right here? Just one. Just right there. Not even in the front of her head. It's like an inch back. She just has one bright highlight. And the ombre, literally nothing happened. <laughs> Next, I'll be showing you how I created this layered haircut. Oh, please do. Please do. Let me show you what the color looks like from the back. Oh, even worse. <laughs> Miss Crea Clip, uh, let's just... Not do that anymore. What do you say? Let's just let's go to a salon next time. <laughs> All right, we got Jasmine Rule up next. Let's see how she does. What's up, everybody? It's Jasmine, and today hey. I am going to do a DIY balayage. So <clears throat> I have this Nordic blonde bleach thing. It's going to be cool metallic whitener, silver blonde. Which isn't really like what I want, but it's what we have, so. Great, because that's not how it's going to come out. <laughs> I promise. Here I did a temporary black dye in my hair. And it's kind of like, I mean, it's obviously washed out. But now I have like quite no. a um, chocolate brown down here. And then further up, it's just sort of like a mousy brown. So I just, I would like to go blonde. But then it's quite a bit of maintenance, so that's right. So I'll do a DIY balayage, and big chance of it going wrong. So yeah, I gotta like like tease their hair and then paint it on. Um, other people they like take a strand and then they paint it on and then um, do it sort of lighter, like with a lighter hand. She's got a little hair knowledge. 
um, I like her sectioning. A diagonal like back section. section like Love it. And then they do like a V formation, saturating the bottom part. Uh -huh. So I guess I'll probably try a couple different ways. Gotta get my gloves Just on. Just experiment on your own head. A bit. Why not? Nervous, obviously. So let's try okay. the V thing. Hmm? Again, so another, another person. Color. I don't think she. I don't think she's using bleach. And it's not going to lighten that much if she's not using bleach. But I like her technique. Really though, it's this is not a bad technique for a person who's never ever done this before and she's doing it on her own head. It's not easy and I like her paint strokes, they're not bad. I'm actually impressed. She's still gonna get a lot of spotting because her saturation isn't correct, but I'm impressed. She's putting in the work. Wow. A little hairstyles on the rise here, huh? Huh, Jasmine? What's up, girl? It got a little ratchet all of a sudden. <laughs> And it's not lightening at all because again, we're using color, not bleach. What is going on here? What is going on? No, girl, comb your hair out before you put color on it. Oh no. You can't just color knots in your hair. It's gonna make it all spotty and weird. Mm, girl. It's been like at least 10 minutes already, so I will come back and check in another ten minutes. Oh, okay. It still seems quite dark, so I'm going to leave it for another It's not going to get any lighter. Have to wash it off. It's time to rinse it off. There seems to be a reoccurring theme in all these videos of their hair not getting light enough. You gotta use bleach, girls. Her hair looks good, though. I think it's lightened a little bit. <laughs> it looks super awful. It's, it again, like it's not that bad. This. It looks like instead of sun kissed. The sun has taken a golden shower on my head. For how bad this could have gone, again, it's not that bad. Guess I'll see you guys on the next time. Hey, so mad. So, one thing we can all take from those videos is that don't do an ombre or balayage at home. I mean, you know what? You can do other things to your own hair at home, but like balayage, ombre. Those are super complicated and it's just gonna turn out wrong. Just really, really wrong. Don't try it, okay? Just don't. And if, I mean, if you're gonna try it, at least use bleach, okay? <laughs> That's all I ask. Just at least use bleach so like something happens to your hair. And today's Instagram shout out goes to Anna. This is her Instagram name and this is what she looks like. She says, hi Brad. First of all, I've been obsessed with your videos for a while now. I just love them so much. Thank you, babe. So as you can see, I have a pixie cut at the moment and I've always wanted long hair, but because it's so fine and thin, it just looks like poop. You feel me? Um, yeah, girl, I feel you. So I've been thinking about growing it to a bob or a long bob, maybe. I would also like to dye it pink or blue, so I feel like it would look way better if it was a bit longer. Should I keep the pixie or should I let it grow a bit longer and dye it? Or maybe something completely different? Okay, Anna. You need to keep your pixie. It looks so fierce on you. It just gives you like that edgy, cool girl vibe. You know what I mean? I think a chin length bob would also look amazing on you. I love the pixie. I think you should go even shorter, to be honest. Love it, you rock it. And also, pink for sure. You need to dye your hair pink. It's gonna look bomb, you better do it, okay, you her. All right, thank you guys so much for watching today. Don't forget to live your extra life, and I will see you all next time. Peace.